the real terrorist. Terrorism means violence promoted by a group to achieve or maintain supremacy, rule, principality. Now pay attention to this word principality now. Ephesians chapter 6 verse 12 says, For we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against powers, against the rulers of the darkness of this world. Could the true terrorists be the creators and promoters of this false image of a gay Christ? When we think of violence, we always think of physical violence, but violent is also means likely to distort or injure meaning, phrasing, or intent. This is why your leaders are busy now, changing the meaning, phrasing, and intent of words. Instead of being called a male or female, they are changing it to a genderless society. They are transforming us to a genderless society, where we are called persons, or a friend, instead of boy or girl, or male or female, or man or woman. This is how they are distorting the meaning, phrasing, and intent. This is how they are changing the word. They are busy now changing the word, distorting the word, distorting the content of our character, changing the nature of our character, distorting us, twisting our true nature, our right nature, our straight nature into that which is crooked. They are changing the word because in the beginning was the word and the word was with Yahweh. And the word was Yahweh. And in doing so, and in changing the word, they are changing your perception of the word. Your perception of reality. This is forced upon you now. This is forced upon your children. When they go to school, this is forced upon them. This genderless society this acceptance of the LGBT community, the acceptance of this genderless society is being forced upon your children when they go to the very schools and academic establishments that you send them to to be educated. This is why Matthew chapter 11 verse 12 says that the kingdom of heaven suffered violence and the violent take it by force. They are doing violence to the word, violence to the law, violence to the laws of Yahweh, violence to you and your true nature, violence to our mind, violence to our well-being, violence to our shalom. They are molesting your mind and the minds of your children. The word is under attack, so that means that the textbooks are under attack. They're busy right now changing the content, the intent, and the meaning in the textbooks, in the libraries. They're messing with the libraries. That's why back in ancient times, they burned our libraries. They burned the libraries of Alexandria because as long as we had our libraries, we had the true knowledge to connect ourselves back to our true reality. They wanted to take Israel from that which is real. 